be calling you a radical. So I was talking to these uh, young, really brilliant artists today in Ogden. Really young, portrait artists. And I says, well, I got forced into the digital art form. I've been going, I've been almost exclusively using digital art form for the last 10 years. Why? Because I was afraid of the paints on my body and the plaster on my body. So I've had to go digital. I'm a painter, you know, and so fresco artist, you know, and so the only fresco that I've done, I'm getting ready to do another one. We're going to do one in Ogden. I'm working with some muck muck fuckheads, but you know, I said nothing but young organic Ogden artists. They're out there. Quit abusing us. You know, and your fucking LA freak show. They suck. I've seen my fresco I've done. You know, I did that a few years ago. It's ecology, fuck. I've just left it outside. You know, so. All that fucking. <laughs> Gotta have 10,000 of them across this fucking. Every time I get ready to fucking do something to that white wall of mine, I did that in. What, 88? I don't believe, but... So anyway, let's talk environmentalism. Is the ecology stupid? You know, digital? I've fucking done enough. I mean, you think about my digital work or, you know. I was showing a woman uh, my spiral jetty video. She's like, oh, oh, historic nature. Where's your fucking statement, you know? Everything that's going on culturally... And you're just making art for the sake of making an art. I understand that if you're young. Not if you're old. Because you know, the young artist is running off the intuitive mind. They'll get it. They'll get it. A lot of great young talent I see. Really good young talent. Very impressive. And not many, but a couple. So, salmon numbers. The Copper River number is so fucking low. There's no gill netting. You know, the tide pools. You know, I've been going through and there's this sighting. No cow, and they're showing all this fucking great. There's some life in the tide pools, but it's down 99%. I can't believe this normalcy bias that has been developed. And everybody's like, okay, what's going on? This fucking drought is beyond it. Look at these fucking, all my videos up there, there's no snow. In June, fuck, there's snow there in August. Every, I mean, this, what's going on environmentally is... My spiral jetties prove how cute rat. I mean, it's on. My fucking grass doesn't even grow. Even when it rains, it doesn't grow. My trees all died. My fucking dogs died. Environmentally, fucking leukemia. Cancer rates have increased 38%. In the last decade, no one gives a fuck. <laughs> I mean, this is a freak show. People are so incommunal. Fucking. I mean, then. What blows my mind the most of what's going on in the last decade, people are trying to justify a 99% collapse in the tide pools, and you got will for useful idiots that are out there trying to fucking justify this. Salmon fishing, they catch no salmon trying to justify this. Unarguable fact is the Pacific Ocean's collapsed over 90% in the last decade. The tide pools are down 99%. The fucking salmon numbers, you don't like, this is without gill netting. This is without fishing. That's a kill there. They're ground nesters. She'll fake like she has a broken wing, lead you the predators away from the nest. They're so famous right here. Not anymore. So fucking desperate. Digitally, the sound matters. It's not just about visually. Visually, it matters. Andy Warhol. Fuck, a cranberry sauce. You dropped it. You never dropped it. Sun got my eyes, coach. That's the famous rail line that goes across the Great Salt Lake right there. I tore out the fucking wood causeway. I have a vase. It's made out of it. He drowned right at the end. Great Salt Lake's going dry. The toxins that are rising up off this fucking lake, we don't even know what the fuck they are. Sons of my eyes, coach. No one gives a fuck. 
The counterculturist movement, we had a lot of strength and a lot of power going. Who fucked that up? Trump. And his useful fucking morons. Well, a bunch of prison riots. Black Lives Matter hijacked by a bunch of fucking billionaire socialists to the left. Indentured fucking slave fucking free market capitalists to the right. Oh my God. For the ignorant of inherited the earth. So, artistically, I'm like, you're making art with no state. I, I met this great artist from fucking Long Island today. He's relocated to Park Shitty. Making these great sculptures, and I'm like, well, they have very much an Olympics feel, and we start talking the Japanese game, and it just right over his head. There's so much artistically that can be done. Kevin Blanche has been doing it. Where are you going to put it? I mean, it's not the art, it's security. We started talking about the moment. We're talking about Leon Black and Depths. The Epstein cult fucking that captured fucking. Start talking to the great American artist, Grant Wood. Grant Wood got leukemia the same time I did at the same age, 51. Killed him. American fucking. Gothic American toxic. I've done all that fucking incredible work. Talk about the art. But unless the curator's there, we were just talking about Joseph McDougal, the ice in the desert. I was out at the spiral jetty when I met that guy. Yeah, he's fuckhead creepy Gates' is fucking personal artist. You know, we're talking about Peggy Guggenheim, and we're talking about... Well, Guggenheim's the one who found all these guys. You know, the W.A. sponsored these guys. They had a fucking dime. Warhol, fucking Pollock, all of them. Grant Wood. Now, you think about the oligarchs, or the oligarchs' children. The Guggenheims of our day are, what, Jeff Bezos? Bill Gates? Elon Musk? These creepy fuckers have no culture. They have no education. They have no background. They're just billionaires for the sake of CIA making them billionaires. They don't know shit. They're, they have no cultural fucking... You know, Guggenheim, Peggy Guggenheim had a cultural fucking... Even though, you know, it was all about sex with young artists, but still... I always go back to Deshaun, nude descending down staircase, dead purple fucking nude found in fucking elevator. I always go back to Deshaun. That great interview with the New York Times critic. She was so brilliant in that. I go back to Edie Sedewick, well, on Merv Griffin. Talk a man, he has a talk. I do all his talking for him. He had Edie. I never did find my Edie Sedewick. Marcel Duchamp, who stole everything. I mean, Warhol was his bastard child, but he stole it from Elsa Plush, used to use the tomato soup can bra. He used to call him Maras. Mars, Mars, Mars. Elsa Plush. You're ready, mate. They're so brilliant, so fucking fantastic, you know what? He's like, why do you give a fuck now, 30 years after the fact? I made that fucking art 30 years ago. I gotta show you this quickly. Why do you give a fuck now? But she was elegant, she was sophisticated. We had the art curator. We had the critic. They were brilliant. They weren't oligarch wannabe fucks. That's just dust off the great cell. That's the lake. That's the old lake bed. That's the old marsh. See it just fucking rising every night? It's called dry lake effect. There's no cars, there's no nothing, it just rises. The molded grapes of wrath. What's coming off this Great Salt Lake? The Great Salt Lake was a perfect fucking love. I showed a woman my spiral jetty fucking video. She's like, whoa. I said, that's 2012, at the perfect jetty. Talk about digital art. I've had to use the digital genre because I was afraid of the fucking oil paints. I was afraid of the fucking plaster. I was afraid of it because on my skin. I was given two months to live with AML leukemia. I was forced into this spot. You know, I think back on what I've done digitally. Wow, wow, what a catalog. Oh my God, what a catalog. So you're the artist, and you're not making a fucking stand, and you're not making a statement. You know? Dolly? Goya? Picasso! Dolly? Goya? Picasso, Picasso stood up to the machine, the activist artist. Even Warhol mocked them. Stood up to it. Jackson Pollock 
fucking Arnold Blanche, he was the Depression, or Thomas Hart Benton right there. I envision one day, fucking a statue of Christopher Columbus standing on this tallest Rocky Mountain peak. Fuck, <laughs> these oligarch fucking freaks. But we broke free for a while. We've only really had a few great American artists. Brantwood, Andy Warhol, Jackson Pollock. The whole scene's been captured for 40 years. All the fucking artists and all the oligarchy and all the bullshit that's... You know, I started Anonymous. Well, I didn't start Anonymous. I started the movie Mass March. Kevin Blanche started that right here on, based on D. Smith's funeral today. I painted that out of my head. Just came home one day after fucking visiting Annika. I painted a painting of you before she died of cancer, before she got with you. It's nothing else matters. It's the ecology, you stupid. I look back at all those fucking, in the 50s, 60s and 70s when I grew up, being in New York, being in San Francisco. Smells like spaghetti. Must be Ferengetti. I stayed up all night, read a book in the basement of City of Lights. Gene Stone's funeral's tomorrow, Orange County. I wrote a poem for Peter Stoop's dad behind the blue door in La Jolla. Well, maybe I'll do that. He was friends with Ferengetti. Smells like Kerouac. Oh, the plutonium. Oh, the plutonium. I mean, I met a fractal digital artist today. Marco Metalbron. He says, oh, I got one. I got a Metalbron piece. We go from Einstein to Metalbron to Blanche. Plutonium. It's not a fabric. Bend the fucking antenna. It's a glass. This is the most historic time in human history, to be honest. My protesting at the moment? Fuck, how perfect. How perfect. My spiral jetty videos? Oh, fuck, how perfect. My fucking work inside fucking the shutdown of San Onofre, leaking that out, fucking Diablo can There was an artist today, I saw him, he had a digital photograph, and he did enhanced it and blown up of a pier looking down. I said, I've been on every fucking pier. All 54, that's Fukushima. He says, I bet you can't guess what that pier is. And I says, how much you want to bet? You want to bet a beer? Yeah, I'll bet you anything. 54 piers of I've been on them all. I'll guarantee you I know what pier that is. There's no way you know what it is. I said, it's Pismon. His wife's like, whoa, 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 whoa. How'd you, come on. You know, the world is run by those who show up. What 10 years of fuck up? Put me in coach. I'm ready to play today. The problem's not the art. Well, it is the artist. They're not. I mean, what about the fucking critic? What about the museum? Kevin Blanche is the museum. My paintings have hung in the Enola Gay hangar. They've been there. I mean, they're right there. But when YouTube smashes you down and the world fucking flees from you and runs from you because they can't handle the fucking truth, Fukushima met an artist from Salt Lake and he's like, oh boy. Fukushima. I says, yeah, hello. I says, you want to talk digitally? And we were having this debate, me and some young artists about digital art. I'm like, okay. And I showed him my first Fukushima video. Okay, if it's digitally, if it matters, and, you know, what about that video? He's like, oh, oh, how about my spiral jetty business? Oh, I mean, fuck, on location, incredible fucking. How about my fucking sending off for shutdown videos? Holy fuck, Diablo Canyon, fucking Indian Point. How about my interview fucking right in Mitt Romney's face, in fucking Mike Lee's fucking face, in Governor Herbert's face, in fucking, I mean, my video fucking Donald Trump, Fukushima, fucking digital art. If it's all about digital art, I sold two of my videos. I, whoops. I sold two of my videos. I remember a woman from Australia says, Kevin, you've got 800 videos. Here's a dollar for each one. And you keep them. 
I paid for my trip to fucking California. I sold a video to a New York City, or excuse me, Chicago museum curator. Thirty-five hundred. Woo woo. Put me in, coach. I'm ready to play. The fucking ecology has collapsed. You know, we get into the fucking... This ground is so scorched. My trees have fucking died. My dogs fucking died. My neighbors all fucking dying. And that's all over the western United States. This heat bubble over the... All just coincidence. Look, shoot. The dead tide pools. And everybody's going to normal some guys. They're going to try to justify... Oh, look at this. I found some... Star I find some starfish, too. I find a few. 1%. I never use fucking extinction. I use genocide. But you're okay with that. Obey, consume, obey, consume. Die young of cancer. How'd they do it? Wanted by jet stream. Sure, by cable TV. I'm fucking believe I'm fucking believe I predicted all this, son of Cassandra. They're lying, lying. These full fucking blown out meltdowns are going to release a plasma. It's a plasma. It's a gas. It's going to break the fucking chain. It's going to wipe out the tide pools. It's going to fuck big fish, eat little fish. The salmon will collapse on 2016 because they go to sea for five years. The Great Salt Lake's going to go fucking dry. The fucking, I predicted all of it, all of it. Including buy Tesla, buy Tesla in 2011. Go all in on Tesla. Go in on all in the upper group. Play back the tape. Short silver. I mean, play back the tape. I'm gonna give you cancer. I got cancer. <laughs> I don't know. It's a weird fucking place I live in. Mentally, physically. It's so abstract. Hmm, what a sunset tonight. There's no mosquitoes. There's no bugs. Butterflies. Used to be just. Fuck, 10 years ago, right now, you see hundreds of butterflies here right now. Hundreds. There's hardly even any mosquitoes. No jackrabbits. No birds. That's the big thing, the bird collapse. I mean, it's getting to the point where we're go humans will be the only species, wild species on fucking earth. We're getting there. Fuck, how creepy. Quality of life, mental stability, I mean... It's just crashed. It's a fucking disaster. I think it's so historic. The sun's setting right now. Right at, that's right at the Golden Spike. That's right there. That was May 10th, 1869. I remember being right there at that Frank Lloyd Wright fucking masterpiece right there. They tore it down. Frank Lloyd Wright, fucking Leslie Hodson, Prairie School, the only one in the world I grew up with. I used to walk to school holding hands with Everett Ruiz right here. They tore it fucking down. Oh my God. They could have fucking... Uh. The Mormons are tearing the frescoes out of the temple. They fucking told down the airport, built this big homogenous box. What kind of fucking freak show do we live in? I don't know. Talk to some really great artists today. Just disconnected. I mean, good artists. Good artists. Just no statement, no why, no rhyme, no reason. Hmm. Got this really cool dragonfly raining around the house. I've never seen one like him. No birds. Well, here we go, a few sparrows. See that fucking smog rising up? No cars. No cars. Stray like effect. It's a freak show we live in. Why are you making these fucking videos, Andy? It's a lot easier than painting. I painted and made frescoes fucking constantly till 2011.
Until fall 2011, I got cancer. I even made some after them. My skins, they've been everywhere. The thing about my skins, fuck, they've been in the old towers. They've been in the new towers. They've been, fuck, where haven't they been? All over the world. Peace Vigil, Vienna, Budapest, Prague, Copenhagen. Up and down. How about my work on the coast of California? Marine biology in the desert of Utah. I got that out of a fucking tide pool. I believe in Pismo. Somewhere near in the central coast. God, has it really been that long? Four years. Four years. On that alone. She died in 99. January 11th. 38. Training girl, Annika. Where'd you sleep last night? Don't you fucking lie to me. I slept in the dead fucking pines with the sun from the Fukushima. The, the suns, they always shine. Way up from and high. Purple Mountains Majesty, I see, I see, oh, tis of thee. From nuclear radiated fucked up sea to dead fucking nuclear radiated sea. Now they've changed. Now we have five oceans. National Geographic said so. We have the Indian Ocean, right? Yeah. We have the Atlantic Ocean, right? We have the Pacific Ocean, right? <laughs> now it's all the Dead Sea. We have the Arctic Ocean. Anarchy. Arctic. Now we have the Southern Ocean. We have five now. Hmm. Go buy a new globe. Why are you making all these fucking videos? These movies. A lot easier than painting. I'm going to go back to painting soon. I'm going to do a big fresco soon. We'll be back in Monterey. Doing the Tide for work on the 23rd. Thank you everybody who supported this historic fucking work. You know, low tide, got to do it. Like Malay, I step back from the broader perspective. <laughs> Love Malay's work. Love his fucking work. Dead tide pool jumping, Bobby McGlanch, world fucking record. Baby. 2021, Japan. Fuck, what a fucking. People are just fucking. Now you know how they accepted when they cut down all those coyotes, when they killed all the natives. I c cannot tell a lie. Grant Wood on Balco. George Washington cut down that cherry tree. American toxic, American gothic. I made the art. So much of the fucking beautiful art. Where's your baseball bat in your can? Should we hit one for the road? Yeah. I don't think you got a can. Long video. I know. I don't care. What Google's done to me, I feel a lot like Bo Jackson. I really do. If you don't know about Bo Jackson, you know, people are the greatest athlete probably ever. Baseball, football. Fuck. His whole beautiful athletic career still. Not him. Cranberry 
sides. No birds. No butterflies, no insects, no birds, 105 fucking degrees, 100 in San Francisco, fire, Mimi, obey, consume, obey, consume, die young of cancer and weather. It's the ecology, stupid. When a doctor looks you right in the eyes, tells you you got two months to fucking live, get your oars. When you hold your love of your life's hand at 38 years old and watch her die and watch him load in the body bag. Watch your father die young. All by the nuclear industry. Talk about make the art. Sound matters digitally. Where's the frogs? Where's the screeching toads? Where's the crickets? It's a great salt lake. That's the great flyway right there. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. No one cares. No one cares. I never believed it. The sound of silence. Like the ultimate cancer it grows. You all act like you don't fucking know. La 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 I always go back to Scarborough Fair. You know how old that song is? Those voices. Quietly. Digitally, sound matters. I'm gonna have to start selling these digital paintings of mine. There's some important ones. Really, some of these videos are Van Gogh's irises. They're the Mona Lisa. They're Warhol suit cams. Picasso's horse. The Grant Woods, George Washington. They're Jackson Pollock's first grip.
¿no? No mosquitos, no butterflies, no birds. Birds are singing so happily, so joyfully, so playfully. Sound matters.